Hi, I'm Dan Helfrich, CEO of Deloitte Consulting. And culture is what drives our organization and any organization. But how do you bring that culture to life? We call them everyday equations. And one of those, reality, is greater than reputation. It became really clear to me that we need to, to focus on reality is greater than reputation because of all the second and third hand commentary that I heard in our organization and other organizations where someone would say, so-and-so isn't good at that, or so-and-so always struggles to complete that. And when you look underneath that comment and ask the question, well, when's the last time you saw so-and-so behave that way or do that or struggle with that? The answer was, hmm, not recently. Or maybe it's, actually, I heard that from someone else. This is an issue in the workplace because reputation can stay with individuals far longer than it should. We all are imperfect beings and we all say we want feedback, we wanna get better, we wanna grow. Well, if you're in a place where one mistake, one attribute that happened a while back stays with you for the duration of your time in an organization, then you don't actually have the capacity to grow and learn and development. And the way you push back against reputation is by asking simple questions. Well, when's the last time you witnessed that behavior yourself? Are we sure that's a current view versus something in the past? Who'd you hear that from? By pushing people to challenge the source of their information, you then force them to grapple with, well, is this the reality of how I view that person? Or have I actually fallen victim to putting reputation at the fore instead of reality. Bottom line is this, an organization that has too much reputation and not enough reality can't be the inclusive, equitable environment that creates pathways for learning, growth, and development that they want to.